Final one. Here we go. Final one of the season, that is. <laughs> Here's what we got in the Fortnite shop. Ninja Turtles, still here. Very cool. This uh, may be the last time to pick it up, so grab it if you want. April, Splinter. This dude, Lewis Hamilton, never heard of him. Apparently, he's famous. That's cool. Decent skin. Lady Gaga. Superheroes. Now, let me, let's talk about the superheroes real quick. I picked up Jewel Terra yesterday. This is the style I'm doing. I'm trying to get it super sweaty. However, check this out. I don't know if you guys knew this. Let's go to my locker real quick. I'm kind of actually a little upset about this. You can't get it true black on black. Like, look, it. If if I try to go black, there it X's it out, and I was like, what? And so I was. I mean, I'm just doing gray, gray on gray, uh, or silver on silver, and it looks cool. It looks cool. It's, uh, I, I, I don't know if it's just like an effect of the skin, but like, dude, I'm getting some sick shots. I literally got a victory last night i got a and then the next game i played just now right before recording got another freaking victory so that's like i mean i don't want to say the number but maybe like seven crown victories not even maybe five i don't have a lot i'm not very good but five, i'll take it all of them i can get so i don't know what it is about this skin but it just makes me better i like hold on let's i was trying to I was gonna, I was thinking about editing together a video, but like, watch this freaking shot I got off, dude. Check this out. Hold on. Hold on. Wait for it. Check this out. Oh, right in the freaking face, bro. <laughs> and I, by the way, I don't know if I'm going to post this or not. Well, I posted a screenshot of the victory all like hey snuck one snuck one in this dude sorry we're getting away from the shop but we you know whatever it's the it's the final one the shop's not that crazy right now um this if you watch this i won this and i'm i'm like down to down to the the last it's just me and this other person and so like look we're kind of like we're not boxed up but we're you know we're like i'm trying to i hit him up i pinged him a few times see yeah, yeah yeah but then here we'll fast forward it i knew i had this because i had the i that person that i sniped i grabbed their um medallion the dash medallion cerebrus and like, watch, I knew I had this because I knew he was going to get stuck in the storm. And that's exactly what happened. So like, so there he is. Okay. Going for the kill. And this is when I realized, watch this, that I knew I had it because the storm's locking in on us. Okay. He boxed himself in. I was like, you're not going to, you I know he's not a skilled enough player. And I was like, he's done. So I was like, I'm just going to run for it. I freaking... And watch. I was like, this is it. I'm, I'm waiting for him. I, I don't see him. And I'm like, there's no way he's getting out in time. There's no way. So I was like, I'm just going to keep going. Boom, baby. Probably my final victory for the season. You got to see it. There you go. I don't know if I'll post that. It's not really post worthy. Uh, like I said, I did a screenshot of that. Very cool stuff. Did you... How many... What, what was your stat? Did you know you can look up stats, dude? You want to see it right now? You can look up people's... Like, look. Uh, stats? We'll do... I mean, everyone knows my name is Quantum... Uh, look, you can look up, like, Bush Camp Dad. <laughs> like, I was looking up people's stats. This is just public knowledge. You can turn this off. You can turn off your stats so that the public can't see it, but whatever. I don't care. I don't got nothing to hide. I know I'm not good. So it literally just put your name in here. I I can put your name in and and see your see your your stats. So 830. This is crazy. 191 hours. I've been on that grind this season, bro. Woo! Tell me your stats in the comments. I want to know.
this is pretty bad, but let's talk about the season. You know what? Let's talk about the season after we finish the shop. Um, but this is like the season that I've really connected with Fortnite. And like, I was like, oh, okay. I'm like all in. I was like about it during season one. And then now this is my second complete season that I just basically no lifed and I'm just like all in. Um, so I am kind of sad to see it go, but let's get back to the shop here. We got, Ooh, Tiger. What is this? Tigris? Ooh, chapter four, season four. Let's check out the true rarity of Tigris. Let's see. What do you think? I mean, chapter four, pretty, pretty, Oh, 24. Look at the drop off actually here. So interesting. Like some of these skins, like, look, it's only been, it came out last chapter, but it had one run, three day run, came back. Like, what is that? 13 days later? Or no, no, uh, 33 days later. And then gone. Crazy. That's so interesting why they do that with certain skins. And like, that's, that's like an original, you know, Fortnite skin. That's not like a, you know, somebody else's IP. Very interesting. Gia. Ooh, hold on. This is cool. What's up with Gia, dude? Do you guys own Gia? Let's see. When is, uh, I feel like next season. Oh yeah. Okay. This was, yeah. I was like, kind of looks familiar but wait, wait, wait look at that drop off though Ooh, ooh, okay gia do you guys own gia yeah yeah wait, wait, wait. that looked so familiar that i was like wait i know i've actually literally covered this skin i was like okay okay wait wait, wait. um that's pretty much it dude pretty bare skin oh there is a new emote check this out okay what do you think of that let me know kind of cool i just i feel like i would never use it so i'm just gonna pass on it um i can't play them but there's four new songs real quick there's uh, rancid fuel uh, uh metallica uh, uh ramones and rob zombie so i might actually pick up it's so interesting the songs they decide to choose like ruby soho is it is a popular rancid song but um you know, there's some like fall back down. That that was like the radio hit. Like I don't understand. And then fuel is a sick. Give me fuel. Give me fire. That's a good choice, especially for uh, Fortnite festival. But again, like they have a lot of like way more popular songs. Bright bomber. Bright bomber. Bright bomber. It's like featured in uh, all of their advertisements. You know, I mean, season one. It makes sense. But it looks like there's like some type of variation skin that's coming out for the new uh, battle pass. Um, so that'd be interesting to see. Dude, I'm telling you. Um, wait, when does the Fortnite crew uh, skin update? Is it update every at uh, the top of the month? So does that mean we're getting a new Fortnite crew skin? Let's let's peep this. Hold on. Always on the current season of the Battle Pass. Looking for the Battle Bundle. Add 25 levels to your Battle Pass at any time. Whoa, I didn't know that. Hold on. You can add, If you have Fortnite Crew, you can add 25 levels to your Battle Pass at any time. That's crazy. I mean, I had no problem getting to 200. I did it like a couple weeks ago. But when does this... Let's see if... It, huh. When does it say it ends? I don't know. We'll figure it. We'll just wait and see. Um, I'm feeling like tomorrow. Now, let me ask you a question. Because you probably know more than I do. Like, at the, the beginning of a season, is the shop sick usually? Like, I mean, ex and we're not talking Battle Pass. So, excluding, ba obviously, Battle Pass is going to be cool. We're going to have a lot of things to talk about for that Fortnite crew. Um, but is, is the... Is the shop usually cool, like during, you know, the transition into a new season, the first couple of days, or is or do they just kind of maybe leave it pretty bare and, and just like focus on battle pass? Let me know in the comments um, what they usually tend to do. I'd be interested. I would be interested to see if they like stack the shop along with battle pass. 
because halfway through season two here is kind of when I really, really locked in and, and uh, started paying attention to the shop and really started like collecting skins and then what led me to do these videos. Because I just like talking about it, you know what I mean? And um, apparently you guys like to talk about it too. So it's rad, you know. I like hearing about people, you know, people come, oh, dude, I've got 800 skins, you know, like all this cool stuff. I've been playing since, you know, chapter one, season two. Like, that's so dope, dude. I love hearing about stuff like that. Like, I brought up the question about the Marvel b Battle Pass from chapter two, season four. And I'm like, bro, like, I was like, imagine if that was released today, you know. That'd be so cool, dude. That w That's an insane Battle Pass, dude. Just in all Marvel and all like top characters, you know what I mean? So rad, dude. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it for the shop. Um, yeah, I'm honestly gonna be uh, kind of missing this season. Um, for oh, you know what? We didn't really. Uh, oh, Storm Racer, here we go. That's actually kind of sick, dude. This is going to go with, um, this came out the same season that, uh, the Marvel stuff did chapter two, season four. Interesting. It's a pretty cool skin, but like we're getting that motorcycle rider guy in the battle pass that's confirmed. Uh, so like, we'll kind of, you know, already have motorcycle guy. So I think we're good on that. Um, how did we just completely miss this whole section right here? <laughs> I don't know. This is getting crazy. Let's, let's look up uh, ba bocce, like bocce balls. You ever play that game? Let's look that up. Bocce, that's kind of cool. 43, 46, not, not, not rare, but cool skin. Criterion was, we, I know we went over this. And in fact, I know I went in depth because I was like, Hey, oh, this is one of those 2000 V bucks skins, but at least this one's like pretty freaking cool looking. You know what I mean? I know that was just in the store. And then Hitman also just in the store. This is a hilarious skin, by the way. I do like this. I would never buy it just cause I, I feel like I would just wear it once. Maybe make a video about it. Hey, hey look at it. I got this skin. And then just, it would sit there. Um, so, oh, wait, wait, let's look at Bocce's variant. This is dope. Ooh, that's actually sick. Let me know if you got that. Let's go through this one more time just to make sure we didn't miss anything. I think we're good. Um, yeah, so like I was saying, yeah, I think we're good. Um, let me know if you're going to get Battle Pass. Honestly, dude, like... I'm telling you, you the, it, the minimum you have to get is Battle Pass, all right? It's just, it's just worth it, all right? Like, I didn't really connect with Fortnite until I bought the Battle Pass. Well, I bought the Ninja Turtles bundle just because I saw some videos of people playing it, and I was, like, apprehensive because I promised myself I would never buy any cosmetics on a video game ever. Here we are. And so, but I was like, whatever, you know, so I bought the bundle and instantly the game became more fun just because I was using Ninja Turtles. And then I had leftover V bucks when I, cause I ended up, I got the, uh, third tier. I had enough left for, for, uh, battle pass. And I was like, well, you know, Peter, I don't really understand what battle pass is, but it's got the Peter Griffin skin. And I, I would see people rocking that. And I was like, oh, that's fun. You know, whatever. I'll just use the rest of the leftover V-Bucks on that. Um, And then having Battle Pass and then realizing, like, you got to grind for it. And then it gave you all these quests. And it, gave, it gave, just gave you, like, you know, basically a little story to the game. Little, you know, missions and things that go on. And it gave you, like, a... It's an alt like it's just a cool alternative. Obviously, you don't have to do it to play the game. You can just play Battle Royale, get freaking insane at building, and get as many dubs as you can. But then also, I mean, there's just so many different ways you can play this game. There's so many different things, you know, play styles, everything. You don't have to be crazy good at the game. You can just literally just get Battle Pass, do the quests, you know, level up, 
collect the skins, you know, like there's no right or wrong way to play this game. It's just like whatever works with you, you know, there's people who just only purely run meme skins just to have a good time, hang out with their friends. If they do well, they do well. Oh, well, at least they're having a good time. I, that's there's nothing wrong with playing like that and then there's also nothing wrong with playing like super sweaty all you want to do is win like that's also cool and i feel like i kind of want to be both you know uh, there's always gonna be a part of me that just wants to chill play the quests grind the battle pass and then also like i'm trying to transition into mouse and keyboard and it's very difficult for me because I've basically just grown up with a controller in my hand and keyboard and mouse. I equate to work. I'm a video editor. That's what I do for a living. And like, to me, a mouse and keyboard is work. I, I love what I do. I love editing, but holding a controller has all since I was five was like my pastime that was my escape you know what i mean and but i'm slowly transitioning into like i i want to get good i want to be good at this game i want to have fun too but <clears throat> there's just I, I the controller's holding me back you know what i mean like i was doing i did i got my first w yesterday i'll pull up the video it, I mean, it's I I posted it on my YouTube channel, lit, not because I because of like, hey, check this sick sick dub out, bro, but literally just to like, I'm super. This is another thing I'm gonna be I'm gonna be doing for uh, season three. Hardcore archiving, dude. Like, it needs to be done. I want I want to do it just to kind of archive and and record the history of me playing me becoming a better player but i also want there to be an archive for the entire community to see and use so that's why every once in a while you'll see these videos that i put and you can watch them or you, you know i'm sure if you're playing consistently right now you're, you're experiencing them so there's not really any, you know i appreciate the likes and and the uh the comments on them um, but like just stuff like this, like the storm, I wanted to, to, you know, archive this storm because in two years, three years, someone's going to start playing and then they're going to hear about, oh, dude, at one point in the game, there was a storm, you know, what? Like and it had th six stages and it, and it got bigger and bigger and, and everyone experienced it and it was super rad. Oh, dude, I want to, I want to look at that. And then I was like, I want to just record raw video of that for somebody to to just scrub through and be like oh dude oh, i can't believe i can't believe i missed that you know and then also like if somebody wants to make a video about you know whatever season two, chapter five season two and they want to use my footage 100 percent, go for you i will not charge you i'm not gonna sue you i'm not gonna whatever you want to use it like it's it's yours use it all I asked, if you look in the description, it just says, leave this courtesy visible. Just I want a little credit. And then link my YouTube page in your description of the video. That's it. It's totally free for you to use. So that's kind of like simultaneously archiving footage for the community and everyone. And then also kind of like, you know, recording the history of my me playing. So that's what I'm going to be doing a lot. Um, just because I, I don't know. I like doing it. Obviously, I'm going to keep doing the the uh, shop videos. Like, ever, I'm trying to... I, this one's coming out late, but that's because I had to pick up my dad from the airport. So, he needed a ride. And uh, I'm not going to miss... I'm not going to miss a shop day. Unless I'm, like, in the hospital, literally. <laughs> um, What was I doing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So... So yeah, I like I literally just posted this yesterday because this is the first like victory I've ever gotten using mouse and keyboard. And it's so funny if, if you watch this, let's scrub like towards the end. It's like I am fumbling, dude. 
Like I'm like you can I, I even even right now I can aim so much better using the mouse. It's crazy. Um but like sw switching guns, I don't know how you how you guys have your freaking loadout or how how you have your you know what you do. I know some people will use the track wheel to to scroll through uh their weapons but you know i have it i have it i have two i have them binded to number two three four and then c and v so i but you can watch me fumble like because i don't have the muscle memory down yet you know what i mean i have the muscle memory of movement i have shift as speed alt as uh duck and slide <clears throat> obviously space is jump um, but you know what, you know what I do? There's this guy, jo Jotsu, Josu, uh, super good player. I watch him on, uh, TikTok. Um, he mentioned that he has his, like, you know how E is, E is like the default to like open chests, grab items. He was like, dude, I use the scroll down wheel for, to, to do that, you know, to, to grab items, grab weapons, open door, you know, whatever. Obviously, I have auto open door on, but so I switched it to that, dude. It's crazy good. Like you don't even think about it. You're just da -da 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 in the scroll wheel, and then because <clears throat> he was like, dude, you can like it's way faster to just ch 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 go like that to open a chest than it is to like s smash or or hold down the E button. I was like, oh, interesting. So I tried it yesterday on this match and a couple others, and uh, dude, it works really well. So maybe try that out. So yeah, I'm gonna be really focusing on um, mouse and keyboard for season three. I'm, I mean, at some point I might exclusively switch over. I tried to do that during season two. Um, they're all oops, <laughs> uh, but I just yeah I, I wasn't having fun and. And uh, it actually, like, kind of upset me to do it. But I think I'm ready now. I think I'm mentally ready now. Where I was like, because back then, you know, that was maybe like a month and a half ago. <clears throat> I was kind of like still in the mode of like, I just want to have fun. I just want to experience the game. And I still wasn't 100% comfortable, but I'm pretty comfortable with the game. So yeah, I literally just won by default because they uh, they got eliminated by the storm. So I just uploaded this just. Because it's literally like my history, you know, my first victory with keyboard and mouse. So there you go. Um, that being said, I'm freaking stoked for season three, man. Like, although I, like I said, I really connected with this game, decided to like go all in, you know, with this season. Um, so I did enjoy the season though, you know. Like, it, it's been cool. You know, I liked... I like the changes, but then, you know, after kind of around the time they're about the end, I'm I'm over it. You know, like, the all the Avatar stuff was super cool. I liked it. it gave a fresh um, feeling to the game. New stuff to learn. That's what it is. It's just new... It's new ways... New things to learn about the game, you know? Because you have to constantly be mastering it, you know? Which is cool. I love it, honestly. Um, but like, you know, I, I, I really connected with it. And, um, but that being said, like I'm ready, I'm ready for change again. You know, that's what I love about this game. I was going to do a top 10. You want to just do it? Uh, should we just do it right now? Or should I do like a separate video? I just don't know if I'm going to have time, dude. Let's do a separate. We'll do a separate video for my top 10 skins of the uh, season. I uh, I was going to try to sneak one in at work today, but it just it wasn't happening. But thank you for watching and thank you for watching this entire season. I will see you next season. Tomorrow is season three. And tomorrow will be the first shot video of season three, which would be rad. I'm, we're going to do a super extensive look at, uh, I don't know why I have this open. Um, <clears throat> we're going to do a super extensive dive into the battle pass and what that entails and what we think about all the skins. And then, you know, I want to hear your feedback, what you think about it. 
Um, and we'll see. It looks like Magneto is going to be the um, kind of uh, <clears throat> secret skin, or not secret skin, but, you know, like the big IP skin that they seem to have been doing, you know, for every battle pass, which is cool. I like that, you know, brings people in. Um, so, yeah, I will thank you all for watching so much. Thank you for subscribing, commenting and everything. Um, and uh, I will see you tomorrow. Bye bye.